Welcome to Mama Cat's Home. Today I'm going to be sharing with you my recollections planner that I use for my YouTube channel. And um, this is last week, the week we just came out of, and this is how it turned out. Um, trying to figure out which planners I want to use next year is becoming a little more difficult than I anticipated. But um, because I wanted to combine this one and my regular home life one. And I don't know what I want to do yet. I'm going to be using those so I save my spot. Um, so that's kind of what I want to talk about today, I guess. I didn't plan on talking about that because I didn't plan on talking about anything other than what I was doing in my planner today. But for some reason that just popped out of my mouth. We're going to be doing the week of November 11th through the 17th. And like I said, this is a recollections, but I'm not buying new planners this next time because I have so many undated planners that I need to use. And I just don't want to waste money because that's what it would be for me to go buy more planners is a waste of money. I'm going to use this one right here. And I got it from Tuesday morning with more fall things. Um, this is, this says, it's got different stuff on it. It says, crisp autumn leaves pumpkin patches and warm apple pie that's what it says over and over again but anyway um i'm going to use it for a header and i'm going to tear off part of it because it's messed up on the end no i'm just gonna snip it or try to snip it that way i won't waste as much i know i'm a weirdo it'll be all right y'all know that if you've watched me any period of time you know i'm crazy not really crazy but whatever but uh anyway i'm gonna just kind of go with this today and talk about the planner things that i have thought about doing i had thought about using a planner that i've had it's an undated planner that i got from walmart it's just a cheap little planner i had thought about using it just to get it used i'll show it to you i don't even remember the name brand but it was just a cheap little planner. I thought about using this one for doing my, you know, home task and my YouTube in here. Because I know this one and this little spot I don't need. So I could put edit and upload there. But then it would be separated, you know. And then this is like a menu planner and things I need, may need to buy. And then this is my daily stuff. I thought about using this just so I could get you know use it for the year and be done with it and use it in combination with my clever fox daily planner which I really want to use and um you know I, I would see but I don't know I don't know if I want to do that or not because I don't know if I want to use that planner and I know it would still be two planners but um it just like for some reason it feels like it would be better for me to do it that way to have like a master weekly list and then a task list kind of not really a list but a master plan and then a task plan that's why that I say use the little no brand I don't know what kind it is of planner and then use the um, clever fox I just don't know what I want to do yet. I don't, I know I've got two months or actually less than two months now, but I don't know. This is the seasonal happy planner book and I'm going to be using it today for my stickers. But I didn't think about the fact that this may not even have like, what do you call it? Oh yeah, it does. Never mind. It only has six. That won't work. So, since it only has six uh, checklist, I'll have to figure out something else. Okay, so I figured out what I'm going to do. I'm going to pull from my leftovers from the last two, month, two months, two weeks of kits in my Bobo Nietzsche or Happy Nietzsche or whatever you want to call it. I'm going to pull from those and grab some checklists and um, some of the boxes as well because I just thought about it. I'm going to need some of those at the bottom. Um, 
I'm going to grab those. There's only six, though. But there are some here. They don't match, though. The colors just don't work. But I guess I could throw in um, this color, and it might work out okay. But I'll put that one on, like, Thursday, because it's going to be the oddball day. So I'm just going to do this. We're just going to see how it works. It may be horrible. It may be absolutely disgusting. I doubt it. But, you know. I can never really... Well, I shouldn't say never because it's not true. I never, like, feel confident in it, though. Uh, getting these down straight. I just don't feel like I'm doing the best at it. See, everyone is crooked so far. And I also didn't even mention it in my other planner that this coming Monday on the 11th is a Veterans Day. I should have actually done some sort of Veterans Day spread type of thing, but I don't have one, and I could have made one, but I just didn't. I don't know why. Okay, I'm going to throw this one in. Yes, it'll be an oddball. Or I could just throw in the other. Let me see. So it'll be the same type of situation at least kind of I could throw in this one on Thursday yeah I think I'll do that it works for me I don't know and I'll put this one in but I don't know I just feel like I've been so confused about what I wanted to do with my planners for 2020 or 2020 or whatever you want to call it. And I'm like decided and then um, I totally change everything. And I'm like, nope, that's not what I want to do. Because I just keep changing it so much. I'm going to use some of this washi. It is some I got from the Dollar Tree. It's got little animals on it. And I just thought it would work out well. Plus, the colors work really well with this. You know what? I'm just going to leave it over there. I'm not going to try to pull it up because I'm just not. Because I'm going to put a sticker there anyway. So, why bother? You know? I don't know. But I just have to figure out what I want to do. I don't know if I really like that little planner. I also thought about giving it to someone else, but I don't know. It's a cute planner, which the back of it has got like, which I don't care myself. If I'm using it myself, I don't care at all, but the back of it has gotten like little like smudgy things. I don't know what that is, like where it's been up against other things in my planner stash like seriously I have a planner stash I have a lot of different planners but um it's been over there and I don't know what to do okay I'm going to be using some of these stickers for the middle and that's why I didn't care if this was like this and I'm hoping because of the way I did this that I can just start here and let it go but we'll see um now these stickers are for a happy planner i feel like this video is all over the place today i feel like i'm all over the place but oh no it's not going to be able to do that so i'll have to go all the way down to this header part let's see if it will work that way oh that way is perfect though i feel like i'm everywhere just everywhere today but since there's a purple over there, I'm going to put a purple over here too. And the little hedgehog, he's got like a, not, it's, it's a shade of purple or bluish purple looking body. I don't know how to explain it exactly. And I want to use this one over here. I probably should use that one for Thanksgiving, but it's okay this is the Anne of Green Gables quote no Oscar Wilde what am I talking about and all at once summer collapsed into fall what am I, I don't see I don't know where I'm at today 
I'm just confused all over the place. Y'all know that, though. If y'all watch me often, you know I'm everywhere. But I'll figure it out. I may not have enough because some of these are like, um, they're like Halloween type ones. So I've got to figure that out. I thought I had enough to do all of them, but I need three more. And I only have two right here. No, that won't work. Okay, never mind. Forget I said that. Just totally scratch that whole thing I just said because it was totally wrong. I was looking at the... Oh, wait. I moved that over. I was looking at the sticker incorrectly. This one says flannels, leaves, pumpkin cider, hayrides, and bonfires. I do need one more of some sort of sticker for the sidebar, but I'll figure that out in just a moment. All right, now let me kind of regroup myself and get where I need to be. Uh, <laughs> The whole reason I was talking about my planners is because I don't know what to do. I don't know which one to do. I got this one, I think, from Target. I don't know what... I don't know if I want to go to a happy planner, which I can. I have plenty. Or if I want to go ahead and do the unbranded... I don't know what brand it is, y'all. Uh, the unbranded planner and the Clever Fox. I know that no matter what, I'm using the Clever Fox this year for like doing um, like a time block thing. I have also thought about just using the Clever Fox and nothing else for my home and YouTube stuff. It is a daily hourly planner, so I don't know if I wanna do that. I've never used an hourly planner before, so I'm like, kind of, uh, do I want to do this? Do I want to put myself in a situation where I have to um, plan out this certain way? Or do I want to go ahead and um, well, no matter what, I'm putting myself in a situation where I have to plan a certain way, but I just don't know if I want to stick with the familiar or go totally off into something new you know what i'm saying if that's kind of what it is because i'm very familiar with what i've got going on i know what i'm doing with it with the happy nietzsche and with the um the recollections i know what i'm doing with those oh that's well, no, it's not the same, but it's very similar. But all of those are very similar. I guess that's the whole point. Oh, I need a different one. I need a plain one. Or one with the, like, looks like stitches or something around it. I don't know. I just feel like I am in a state of confusion with this planner stuff do you guys do that whenever you're choosing your new planners or do you just know what you want to do or do you just keep going with what you got do you just oh no i think i've made a mistake i thought i had one more like with a picture on it but i don't oh no and i don't have any more with the other on it either so I'm going to take this and put it on the sidebar and then I'm going to do the weekend like this there we go that works I think let's get some washi down over here I'm just going to stick with these animal washies today for sure because they're adorable I don't even know where I put the other one oh there it is 
This one has animals on it. It was came from the Dollar Tree. It has foxes on it. But you have to like you have to look for them. They're just in there. But I don't know. The planner situation is just something I have to figure out. And I don't know like where to start, I guess you could say. I've done it so many times, but I've never been this confused. I don't remember being this confused with any of it. And I think it's because I just have too many decisions that I can make. I think that's a problem with our society. We have too many choices sometimes, and if our choices are taken away, sometimes it's easier. Which actually, that's just someone else making your choice for you. But sometimes it's easier. I got this so crooked, and this is going to be the last time I'm going to be able to pick it up and put it back without totally wrecking the sticker. All right, there we go. Got that in, and I'm gonna put another washi under there. And since I'm going with the foxes, I guess I'll use this one. I think this one came from Joann's, but I cannot remember where I got it from last year. But I know I got it from somewhere last year. <laughs> it was either Joann's or Target. And since the last fall, I have not seen, like, washi at Target. Like, I've been looking for it, and I just cannot seem to find it. Okay, so I'm going to figure out what I'm going to put here. And I was thinking about putting in this roast marshmallows thing, but it's not long enough. But if I went ahead and did my bottom washi and then went with and like just went all the way over I think I could do that thing left is doing these and I know that this video is very weird and I am completely discombobulated but I'm trying to just figure things out and it's kind of difficult and being an adult, you have to figure it out for yourself most of the time. 
okay so that's where I put my uploads and that is the day I normally start filming like these types of videos which I haven't been lately and then I edit start really really editing on this day um, it's my big edit day it's the one where I sit and do quite a bit of the editing so that is how it's going to look for this time I hope that this video did not totally drive you nuts I don't even know if I made any sense or even got my point across but the spread is cute to me oh and over here I just put in my subscriber count I don't know why but I just do <laughs> I don't know why I keep up with it it's just something I started doing um and I say that almost every video every video that I do with this planner but you know that's me so if you have any ideas about what you think I should do with my planners if you should think I should just go with the um of course I'm doing the clever fox no matter what go with this one or a happy planner that's the whole thing am I gonna use this or am I gonna do a happy planner and the whole reason I would even use this one is just to get it used pretty much to so I won't feel like I'm wasting money by buying it because I bought it several years ago and like this seriously the first happy planner I ever had which was about three years ago I think I can't remember anyway this was bought the same year and I didn't need both planners and I just don't feel like I want to waste this planner so I think in another way though it may be just something that will be great for a, a little girl who knows I may have a giveaway on my channel you guys let me know maybe I should maybe that's what I'll do I'll have a giveaway maybe I don't know I'll let you guys know next week because by the end I am going to have it figured out but I'm still going to use my Clever Fox. I'm still going to use my um, Faith Planner, my Recollections Faith Planner. I just don't know what I'm going to do about the other part. So anyways, that is all I have for today. I hope that this was somewhat entertaining, even though I doubt it was. Or at least it made you understand that we all get confused sometimes and somebody else needs to make our decisions for us. But we can't have that done because... We're supposed to be grown-ups, and we're supposed to make our own decisions. <laughs> but anyways, thank you guys again for watching. And remember, don't take any wooden nickels, and be sweet. Be sweet.